Hi guys. All right, so I'm on right now because I have a little bit of time. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do the keto protein waffles. It's super easy. So I figured I'd just come on and show you guys. So um, what you're gonna need is some, I use the Quest protein powder. Any kind of protein powder that you like, go ahead and use. I like the Quest products, so this is what I use. Um, a tablespoon of melted butter, half a teaspoon of baking powder, a quarter teaspoon of pink salt, some liquid, you're gonna wanna dilute the batter. So you can use almond milk, you can use heavy whipping cream, you can use water, you can use flax milk, and any kind of mix-ins that you want. Um, I got some of these. I'm making these for my son because he's on his way home from school, so. I'm going to make him some of his favorite waffles. I'm going to use these. Remember those baked believes I shared with you guys? I'm going to put some of the semi-sweet ones in there. But you can use these. You can use blueberries. You can use coconut flakes. Whatever you want. Um, so, let me show you. So, all I did was I got a tablespoon of melted butter in here. Okay? All I'm going to do is throw like a heaping scoop of my cookies and cream protein powder. Okay? Toss that in there. I'm also at the same time going to put my baking powder. I'm going to put half a tea half a teaspoon. Okay? Toss that in there. And then I am going to mix this up with just a fork. Okay. And it's it's super clumpy. <laughs> I'm going to add an egg, one large egg, okay? I just put it all in the same bowl. Okay? And then I'm going to grab my pink salt grinder. And it's going to grind some in here. I don't really measure this stuff. Quarter teaspoon if you want to measure it. And then I'm going to throw some heavy whipping cream in here. I do not measure it. I uh, just throw some up in there. I'm just glad that my son is liking these because they're one of, like in my house, we always have either waffles, pancakes, or biscuits. And it's been hard transitioning with the boys to something that's gluten-free. And so since we found these protein ones, they are so great. They love them. And you can do different flavors. Like a part of the mix-ins, you can do these. You could put um, different like vanilla extract, cake batter extract. There's all kinds of extracts out there on Amazon and stuff. So, all right, let me show you. It actually looks really good. See? Okay. So I already have my waffle maker heated up. Here's Tai Tai. Look, Tai Tai. <laughs> yeah, baby, here. Sorry, my little one's loose. Okay. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to spray. The waffle maker with some coconut spray. And this mix makes about maybe four little waffles. It's about that. Okay. And just close it. And then I'm going to let it cook. It's really that simple. Like, I'm so, so happy. Cause this is really just a quick, simple snack for the boys or quick breakfast, quick dinner. If I want to make breakfast for dinner, that's what I did the other day. Hold on, honey. We're not doing it yet. But yeah, really, really easy. If you have protein powder and it fix your mac fits your macros and you want to have like a good waffle, I love these. It's easy to make and really, really super yummy. Um, we had them the other day with some butter, sugar-free syrup. Uh, we had blueberries, strawberries, and whipped cream. And 
they were just really, really good. Um, the boys and I had it for dinner and it was really yummy. Okay, so this thing is, it. the light doesn't come on or off, so it's like kind of hard to judge it and I just got it, so it smells like it's cooking. I'm gonna give it another minute or so. But yeah, I really, really like this recipe. And it's super easy. The boys love it. I love it. Can't beat it, right? Oh my gosh, look. It's already done. See? So it's a cookies and cream waffle. Check it out. And if you want to do another one, spray that and just add it. Yeah, I think this is going to give me about, I'd say, four of these size waffles. Yeah, check it out. Looks like an ego. Let me see here. And the chocolate chips actually melted. See that? That's the chocolate chip.